Listerine is a common household item known for its antiseptic properties. While used today primarily as a mouthwash for oral health and hygiene, it has been sold as a surgical disinfectant, a cure for dandruff, a floor cleaner, a hair tonic, a deodorant, and finally you can add to the list as a pest repellent. This video today will explore its new status as a bug killer and how you can use it in your everyday life to get rid of pests. 1. Lice Listerine contains alcohol, which is toxic for lice and can suffocate them. A study published in 2011 found that there is evidence that benzyl alcohol, an ingredient in mouthwash, may be more effective at eradicating lice compared with a placebo. The researchers found that benzyl alcohol works by suffocating lice. To use Listerine, soak your head with Listerine until all your hair is completely wet. Gather the hair and put it in a shower cap or plastic bag. Let it sit for an hour or more. Listerine contains alcohol, eucalyptol, thymol, menthol, and methyl salicylate, which are toxic for lice, but safe for humans. But if you feel a burning sensation, then remove the cap and wash it off with water. Next, remove the bag carefully. You will probably see many dead lice inside the bag. Rinse your hair, so you get rid of all the Listerine. The next step is to douse your head with equal amounts of white vinegar and water, massage your scalp gently, and apply the bag again. Leave it on for another hour. If your scalp is irritated you can further dilute the vinegar with more water. Afterwards, rinse the vinegar out, and then shampoo your hair as normally. Finally, use a lice comb to comb out dead lice and eggs. Vinegar loosens the glue the females use to attach their eggs, so you can easily comb the eggs out. Lice don't seem to like the smell of Listerine, especially the spearmint aroma. So to make a Listerine spray, put some Listerine in a spray bottle and mix it with water. Spray your hair regularly as long as the danger of reinfestation exists. Also, boil wash your bedding and clothes to make sure you've eliminated all the blood-sucking insects. 2. Fleas A flea infestation can be hard to eradicate fully, since the pests multiply very rapidly. If you don't want to use chemical treatment, try a Listerine home remedy first. As with most home remedies, the key to success is consistent application. Apply the Listerine treatment once a week, and this will eradicate the fleas over time. Scrub flea-infested pets with a Listerine shampoo, and you will see excellent results. You are going to need a mild shampoo, water, spray bottle, and of course Listerine. To create this flea shampoo, mix equal parts of mild shampoo and Listerine in a bowl. Wash your pet, or yourself, with the Listerine shampoo. Get the animal wet all over, then scrub the modified shampoo over its fur. Concentrate on the armpits and the belly, since fleas like to hide in warm places. Let the shampoo sit for five minutes. Rinse the animal thoroughly. Since flea baths depend on how well you've saturated the fur with shampoo, you may need to repeat the bath to kill all the fleas if you accidentally skipped a spot. For a flea spray, dilute one part Listerine with six parts water. Pour the Listerine mixture into a spray bottle. You can now spray down the animal, furniture or bedding with the Listerine spray to kill fleas. Just remember to keep the Listerine away from the animal's sensitive places such as the eyes. 3. Mosquitoes Too often, the sun and fun of summertime is accompanied by dreaded swarms of mosquitoes that come out to feast on animals, including humans. Mosquitoes can leave you with itchy bites, and the need to swat at the annoying insects constantly can make your time outdoors miserable. If you hate the smell of insecticides and store-bought repellents, you can try to rid yourself of these pests by using Listerine, which will leave behind a much fresher and minty smell. Fill a spray bottle with one cup of Listerine. Original yellow Listerine works best for this. Avoid generic versions with bleaching agents. Spray areas where mosquitoes are numerous with a misting of Listerine. Make sure to spray all nearby surfaces and spray the air as well. Allow five minutes for the Listerine to dry on surfaces. Also spray your skin with a light mist of Listerine to keep mosquitoes from biting you. Allow the Listerine to dry on your skin for a minute 
and reapply as needed if you notice mosquitoes starting to bite again. 4. Ticks To remove ticks, dermatologists advise using tweezers to grasp the tick as close to the skin as possible and pull steadily, no jerking or twisting, until it lets go of its host. There are also special tools that make it easier to grasp the tick close to the skin so you are less likely to leave the mouth parts behind. A tick should not be handled with bare fingers to prevent picking up the germs it may carry. This is where Listerine comes in. Dropping it into rubbing alcohol or a mouthwash like Listerine that contains alcohol should kill it quickly. 5. Garden Pests and Fungicide one of the notable benefits of using mouthwash in your garden is its effectiveness as a fungicide. Plants often suffer from fungal infections, resulting in yellowing leaves, stunted growth, and in worst case scenarios, plant death. The alcohol and hydrogen peroxide in mouthwash can help to combat these harmful fungi, keeping your plants healthy and vibrant. To use mouthwash as a fungicide, mix one part mouthwash with three parts water. Then, spray the solution onto the affected plants, ensuring it coats the leaves, stems, and surrounding soil. You can also spray this solution onto healthy plants as a preventive measure. However, it is crucial to remember not to overuse the mouthwash mixture, as the alcohol content can harm the plants if used excessively. Mouthwash's high alcohol content and strong scent also make it an effective deterrent against garden pests. Insects such as aphids and spider mites can be discouraged from feasting on your plants due to the potent, minty aroma. Additionally, the alcohol will dry up any protective coatings on their exoskeletons, dehydrating them and killing them within a few hours. For this, you must prepare a solution of one part mouthwash and one part water. Spray it lightly on plants that are frequently targeted by pests. Doing this helps eliminate those annoying pests and it kills bacteria and other culprits that rot your plants. 6. Cockroaches Listerine can kill cockroaches when they come in direct contact with it. It is the antibacterial and antiseptic component of mouthwash, specially designed to target bacteria and bacteria-containing elements that can kill cockroaches. Listerine also has a strong peppermint smell that cockroaches absolutely hate. It can work effectively in getting rid of all the moving and hidden cockroaches in your home. Follow these steps to make a mouthwash and water roach repellent. First, add mouthwash to a bowl of water in equal parts. Next, transfer the solution to a clean spray bottle and mix a few drops of dishwashing liquid into it. Now, shake the bottle properly and spray it all over the house. The best way is to spray the mixture directly on the cockroach infestations under your furniture or behind the refrigerator. You can also spray areas in cracks and crevices where cockroaches are known to hide. Repeat this method every two to three hours of the day until the last cockroach vanishes from your home. I hope you have enjoyed this video. If you have, please subscribe to Natural Health Remedies and don't forget to give this video the thumbs up. And I'm sure you're going to enjoy this next video on how to get rid of pests using Vicks Vapor Rub. Thanks for watching and bye for now.